my boy. What's going on, my brother? <laughs> I'm good, man. How are you? I'm good, man. I just I just had to bring it to your attention because I know we talked earlier this year, but I don't know if you realize it's been 15 years since you made your big screen appearance in Half Nelson. So happy 15 year anniversary to you. How? Did, have you Goodness gracious! You want you want to talk about making somebody feel old? Jesus Christ! <laughs> As a young man, brother. I mean, we Did. later we later caught up on Secret Life of Bees and Red Tails officially. But I just I just looking up your dossier, like yo, brother been doing putting in work for for a good minute. And yeah, man. I mean, how do you feel as an actor having grown through this period of being this new age? which is Apple TV is a good example of with these new stories that that we didn't have before and um, playing this character. It's uh, it's amazing, man, uh, for for Apple TV plus to really take a chance on us, you know, uh, a, a, a black story, a predominantly black story that that encompasses so much of not only the things that we go through as young black men, but as just just men growing up and having spotlights put on you before a lot of times you even know who you are as a man it it's it's endearing it's amazing uh, I, I i'm i am truly appreciative as an artist because it it allows me to think like yo us as black brown people of color we're getting an opportunity to really tell all of our different stories and you're a, you're a sneaker exec in this, and um, I know the business of being an athlete has changed. Have you yes. have, have you had a chance to like really think about it? I mean, I talked to Rock a little bit about what season two may entail, but have you had a chance to think about how these new athletes that can get money when they're a kid, like how they how they're gonna operate in this in this world? It's tricky, man. Uh, I, I I personally I think about that often, just because you get a chance to see the talent in these kids so young, so often. And then there's so many that kind of, I don't know, either they don't decide to go or they get hurt or something happens. And you see how, you see how dispensable these companies try to make us seem. Like, oh, he hurt, cool, drop him. And it's it's not fair because I, I, I and even for kids that are a little older, you know, you see these college kids, you know, with the new rules, with the NIL rule now and, and NCAA, all of these different rules that, that are being put in place that are allowing these kids to get money. It's cool and it's good. I, I 200 percent believe that they should be getting a bread. They should have been getting a bread. But there will I, I think it's going to be a scary time when you see how these companies chew up and spit out these kids it's not right it's not right and and i feel like it's it's another opportunity for corporate america to chew us up and spit us out at their will we really appreciate you and meg showing interest in gladiator oh no nah, man that's all meg i don't i don't i don't deal with that kind of shit shit I, 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 no no disrespect the hell with respect you got young people out here killing each other over sneakers. Why you take it to the bank? Yeah, yeah. my man. What, so that's on me? What's the retail on those? 240, 250? You guys are aware that your pediatricians make money off of your kids too. Are they bad guys? Oh, yeah, I mean, the are same. they bad? I'm just come asking on. a question. So? Now, fortunately, my job allows me to help kids all over the country. Right now, I have five teams in five different cities. I'm able to provide them with high quality gear, tournament fees, travel expenses. Brother, brother, you just a suit and fancy street clothes, pimping kids to profit a corporation. Am I right though? That's Am true. I right? Well, I'd be I'd be remiss if I didn't mention that it's also 15 years since your debut on The Wire, and y'all had such mm -hmm. so many cast members from Michael B to Andre Royal, Idris. Um, Sonya John that have come out of the wire and made great careers of themselves, and and, I, and, and not to not to not mention the the late great Michael K Williams. Um, yes. Do you guys ever get together and like as a wire reunion cast and like just talk about where your careers are going and like how you know how y'all have made an impression on the culture? 
you know, a lot of times when we get together, it's not a, we <laughs> we don't talk about the uh, which is crazy, right? You, you when you do something like that, whether it's whether it's something like The Wire or if it's something like winning the war or whatever. I don't think the guys get together and talk about the the war. They may talk about the things that they did when they were over there and the fun that they had while they were over there, but I don't think we necessarily and it's because I think at the time we didn't know we didn't know we were changing the world or we didn't know that we were creating the greatest the arguably the greatest show ever. So whenever I see Sonia, whenever I see Andre, um, whenever I would, whenever I would see Mike, or or anyone, uh, it's it's really just it feels like family time. You know, it, it's a time to to chill. The first question is always, "How's the baby? What's going on with the baby? Where where where's she at? I want to see the pictures. What are you doing over here?" And we just eat, we drink, and we just. We just enjoy each other. We just enjoy each other, man. Well, look, brother, I enjoy all my time with you. Can't wait till we get past these screens and can hang out again. Oh, my God. I can't wait. Congratulations <laughs> on the baby and everything else. And um, Thank you, and big you homie. Doing a good job on the show. I love Swagger. I can't wait till the West, rest of the world gets to enjoy Swagger and follow along with this story. And I hope y'all get five seasons and y'all in college with, with Isaiah and everything else. So, so yes, sir. And we'll keep on watching. Thank you, man. Thank you.